Hey guys, this is Comic You Know and Comic Frontline, and this week I went to the Paley Center to see some advanced TV uh, viewing. So it's Paley Fest Fall TV previews, and I got to see a lot of shows. And I love this event because I get to um, sample all the different shows that are coming out and to see what uh, fall shows have lined up for us in uh, network television. Uh, so that the show I'm reviewing is Life in Pieces. Now uh, I obviously heard of this show. We every year we also do up front show on Media Madness where we talk about the different trailers that came out. So we get to see all the trailers beforehand. And Life in Pieces, I remember, was one of those forgettable ones for me, where I was just like, ah, just trying to be so much like Modern Family. It didn't really impress me by the trailer. But uh, I wasn't actually going to see this show, but we got we got there early, so we sat down, you know, I was like, oh, cool, we get to watch it all pile of Life in Pieces. I was like, oh, but it's going to be like, just going to be like Modern Family. And uh, the show actually really surprised me. I really thought this was funny. Uh, we get to see the four different stories like Modern Family. Uh, one story is about this this guy still lives with his parents and his girlfriend also has a lot of her relationship problems and she lives with her um, ex-fiance. It's a long story. Uh, and also guys, I, I won't spoil the whole story so don't worry, I'm just giving you a little synopsis of what the show's about but definitely not going to uh, spoil big um, points of the show. Uh, the second one is, you know, about uh, Colin Hanks and and his and not you know Colin Hanks's character. Um, they just had a baby, kind of the struggles of that. Uh, the another story is that we get to see uh, that you know kind of the older couple uh, bringing their children to college and that their children are growing up and it's hilarious how they show that. Uh, and then the fourth story is seeing oh wow they're all related and we saw that in the trailer so that's not a spoiler. And we see how exactly how they're all related and, and they get into some interesting turn of events in the end. Uh, I don't want to spoil it but I was like whoa they just like it was, it was something original I thought and I thought it was funny um, the way they, they connected the whole family. Uh, now, like I was saying, I, I think my criticism of the show is the format. It's very much like Modern Family. I think it's going to be in the shadow of Modern Family because it's so similar. Um, but the characters aren't. And I, I guess, well, <laughs> characters kind of are at the same time. But uh, it's less diverse, and, and that's weird. And hopefully it will become more diverse. But uh, it's um, it's kind of like the same format, though, because you, you have the, the couple that just had the kid. Um... You also have the, the parents, so you get to see a little bit of them. Uh, you get, you know, see the, the other family that has older children. So it kind of has the same format, and that is the biggest criticism. But I was laughing so hard when I was watching this show. Um, each family, and or each story, because they're the same family, but each story had something funny about it. And all the actors had really good chemistry. Uh, so... I might give it a try. I was really pleasantly surprised of how funny the show was. I do think the show itself, the stories have to become a bit more original, but the comedy is really there and I think the cast chemistry is there. And that's obviously the most important part of a comedy like this. So Life in Pieces, I'll give three and a half stars. I, I thought it was a pretty good start for the show and I'm going to give it a couple more episodes, especially if it's as funny as the pilot. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed. This is Comic You Know and Comic Frontline. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, description below, there's links from my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. Don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. Also, I have the Kickstarter for Like Father, Like Daughter, and that will be annotated. So I hope you get to check that out also. So I'll see you guys later. This is Comic You Know. Bye.